So today I want to share with you the I Heart Makeup Lip Lava. So these are uh, liquid lipsticks, or they can be described as a lip sort of paint. They're in like this squeezy tube, and just got the applicator there. Product comes out the end. Um, one thing I will say is that you have to uh, be careful with these and not use too much, because if you apply too much of it or at the end there. Um, it can be a bit messy and you don't want too much is the point I'm trying to get to. They dry down to a sort of matte satin type finish and they wear for quite a long time, well pretty much all day kind of. I mean some of them fade a little uh, but not too much. I mean obviously if you are uh, eating food and drink and that sort of stuff then it will, you know, kind of rub it away a little. But no, they are pretty good, um, quite long wearing. One thing I would say though, they're, well, I haven't actually, actually no, I did. Um, I tried like reapplying one point and they don't really, like the second time you apply them or reapply, don't really go too well so you'd have to take off the whole thing and then start all over again. But apart from that, you know, that's the main drawback I'd say for these. Um, so these are the sort of original shades that they came out with because they've now come out with some chocolate coloured ones or something they call like I Heart Chocolate Lip Lava. So each time I wore these I did use this lip liner here. It's the Essence Long Long Lasting. If you can read that, probably not. Long Lasting Lip Liner and this is a uh, retractable one and this shade is 06 A Girl's Dream and this is just sort of like a very um, pretty much the same colour as my lips so I thought to give an even test for all five shades I would use the same lip liner, the one that's pretty much the same colour as my lips and then it kind of gives a nice uh, opportunity, fair chance for each of them and so you know I'm not swayed by the lip liner underneath so one thing I would say, obviously, when I wore the red one, you know, if I was to, if I wanted to make the red more vibrant, then I would use a red lip liner. Quite surprised with the red. I mean, I must admit it might have been the lip liner I was using underneath, like the colour of it, because it sort of toned down the red a bit. But obviously, if you were to use a red lip liner, then it would make the um, red certainly pop more. But when I used the sort of more natural lip liner, it sort of toned down the red and made it very wearable and I just really liked it. it sort of had this pinkish undertone to it and it was just really beautiful. So yes, I will get to the swatches and then I shall be right back. more on the sort of purchasing details, um, you can get them on the Superdrug website and also on the Tan Beauty website, I shall link them down below. Um, and they were two, well they are two ninety nine each, but when I done them through the Tan Beauty website, I believe it was, or is it Superdrug? It was Superdrug or Tan Beauty, I can't remember which one, because that's the only two places you can get them pretty much. Um, in England at least. Um, but no, I think I managed to get them for like four for the price of five or something along those lines. It came in a package deal where you managed to get all five for less, basically. So yeah, I have to say I really, well I was quite surprised. I thought I wouldn't really like this type of product because, um, I don't know. The applicator for one kind of puts me off a little. So I hope you liked this video, if you did please give it a thumbs up and also don't forget to subscribe and comment, uh, leave me a lovely comment if you want or not, whatever you want to do, it's up to you, <laughs> that round. Anyway, I'm getting sidetracked. Uh, so yeah, I hope you liked this video, if you did please give it a thumbs up, also don't forget to comment and subscribe if you haven't already and I shall see you next time because I have more videos to come. Bye bye!